Hey, welcome back to Great Day at 9A on the Wax. What do you think is the most charming small town in our state? There are so many of them, but according yeah. to Afar magazine, they say it's Washington, Connecticut, so we sent Marcy there to check it out. Marcy, how's it going? It's going fabulously. Thank you so much for asking, guys. I'm here with my new friend, Fran. We are talking about the fabulous Hickory Stick Bookshop. It's been around for a minute, right, Fran? You didn't just open your doors the other day. No, my husband and I have owned it for 20 years, but wow. the history of it stretches back 70 plus years, uh, which means that the community of mm -hmm. Washington itself and the larger community has been supporting it and enjoying getting their books here. Yeah. And we love it. And we certainly do, and I love you. Have a fabulous, huge children's book section back there, a little nook for everyone. We've got mysteries, fiction, nonfiction, gardening. Really, the list goes on and on. So if you come here, you're definitely going to leave with something incredible, right? Uh, I hope so. Yes, me too. All <laughs> right, so we are going to pop yeah, over. You want to go out the door? Yes, thank right. you. Okay, so we're going to go out the door. We're going to show you one of Fran's friends next door, Ellen. Ellen actually has a history with the Hickory Stick Bookshop, correct? That's right, yeah. Okay, so she used to work here she and then... She work here and now she does our story hour on Saturdays. It's on FaceTime uh, every Saturday at 12.15 and then it can be viewed uh, subsequently. That but is so nice. Here you are. And now this is nest. her new venture. Fran, and thank I'll you so much. You. Oh, thank you. Isn't Washington just so charming? <laughs> I understand why a far magazine dubbed it the most charming. And look who we have here. Ellen, hi. hi. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. I feel like I just saw you next door. <laughs> you did. I know. <laughs> All right, so tell everybody about the hen's nest. This is so incredible. I feel like it's an explosion of creativity. It is. Um, artists who make glass to jewelry, paintings, yes. um, woodwork, and there are many who do multiple things. Mm -hmm. I am asked by people who are beginning what should I make? Right. And I say, make what you love. Because oh. if you didn't like making it, when people walk by it, it won't call to them. It won't make that impact. Not that at all. Something that somebody put all of their love and passion into, right? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So what I know it's really hard. It's probably picking your favorite child. But what do you have in here that you're really excited about right now? The new pieces, the graphite pieces, are mm -hmm. brand new. Um, pencil. Oh, it's no really way. just pencil. Oh my gosh. That's incredible. That rhino is made out of pencil? Yeah. The <gasps> no, uh, Alex. Pencil drawing. And I'm not going to get out an eraser to prove yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> and then <laughs> we've got have another to take one. My word. <laughs> Over to the right. Yes. Ted, Teddy and his bear. Teddy and Teddy. They're <laughs> so cute. This is incredible. So how does somebody get in to the hen's nest? Do they make a relationship with work. you? Okay. All that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. I have to see their work. And I do suggest that they come into the space whether or not I know who they are. Yeah. And look at it, meet me, because if they don't like the space or me, most likely they don't want their work in here. Who wouldn't like you? Come on. <laughs> come on. I'm not asking for names. We'll talk about that off camera. So what kind of art do you do? <laughs> yeah. So really, unfortunately, we're out of time. But tell us just really quick why you love Washington so much. I love Washington because it has endless surprises. You go around a corner and you find something you didn't expect. Kind of like here at the Hen's Nest, right? Yes, exactly. Fabulous. If people want to come visit you, how can they do that? Uh, walk in the door Mondays and Tuesdays is by luck or appointment. Otherwise, okay. the time is 11 to 5. Oh, thank you so much. You know, Washington is charming, but I find that their residents are even more charming. Thank you so much, Ellen. Guys, sending it back to you. Come visit. I, right. looks, I love that bookstore. It's absolutely Beautiful. amazing. It's, it's